My name is uh, Peter Staniels. I've been in Vermont now for about six years. I retired. I originally was from New Hampshire and I came to Vermont to be close to my grandkids. When we bought this house, we knew the turbines were there. And uh, quite frankly, I thought it was kind of neat to have them in the backyard. Well, one of the things that got me involved with renewable energy uh, from a personal level is in the 70s, I was around driving a car when the oil embargo took place, when you couldn't uh, gas up your car except on odd or even days, depending on your license plate. And oftentimes had to stand in line for, or drive and sit in line for hours in order to get a, a tank of gas. And that was the point where we were completely dependent upon foreign oil. And uh, since then, I became very much involved personally in just in our own houses and things like that, in renewable energy and uh, insulation and all that type of thing to try to wean ourselves away from that dependency. You know, the, the hydroelectric dams, the wind turbines, the, the solar fields and things like that just make us more independent and it's easy to criticize when you have energy flowing, but, but from my past when in fact it wasn't flowing, uh, it could be quite disturbing not only to you as an inconvenience, but to the economy and everything else as a result of that. To me, renewable energy makes a lot of sense. We got involved with it more defensively because of the cost of the conventional heating sources that were available at the time. And as time went on and they became more and more expensive, um, being a little bit more energy efficient made a lot of sense and saved a lot of money and made us a little bit more comfortable, not only physically, but psychologically as well. You know, I look at the, the basic Vermont philosophy, if you will, of energy independence, etc., as being a positive thing, the type of environment I want to be in, the type of thing that I get excited about. You look at the whole basic attitude about are we a throwaway society or not? Are we uh, inclined to try to make life better for ourselves in the future and not be dependent upon other countries or other philosophies to keep us going. That's just who we are, that's all.